So we're out here with uh, Dixon at Import vs. Domestic World Cup Finals. You want to tell us a little bit about the, uh, the combo that's making the car go this weekend? Right. We got a uh, 528 cubic inch Desoma all billet Hemi engine with twin 94 millimeter turbos. We run on M5 fuel for this race. We went from no prep racing in the Street Outlaw no prep King series to prep racing, so we had to make some changes to the car suspension wise and you know springs and tune up and so forth. So uh, this is the first time we've raced full quarter mile uh, on a prep surface, right, so, uh, full, full quarter mile period. And uh, it was a little challenging the first few uh, qualifying runs, but the last one we got, we got in there pretty deep. We were tenth in qualifying, and when we did it with two speeds instead of three because we blew up the second gear in our car. So, so was it a busy okay. night last night? We, it was busy up until about ten o'clock. We finished uh, freshening up the transmission, uh, made the changes that we think we need to make to be successful today, and uh, we're going to see what happens in round one. We should be should be good. How long have you guys been working with this car? How, how this car was brand new exactly okay. two years ago. came out as a radio car. Uh, and then uh, James Goad with Reaper uh, asked me to come to No Prep with uh, No Prep King series in their first season. So we had to do a quick conversion on the car. And we made a couple races in the first season. Then we ran the full second season. And we, we, we kept improving with the car. And then we just finished up the last season, which was season three last weekend in Texas and came straight here to run this, uh, this event. And adjusting on the way, too, I bet. Adjusting on the way, adjusting when we got here, getting used to figuring out this quarter mile stuff, especially with a prep surface. You know. Any story stick out of you is like a craziest or a favorite or anything like that? The favorite race we had was in Colorado. We were taken out. That was uh, about a month and a half ago. We were taking out all the heavy hitters and straight outlaws. We took out Daddy Dave first round, Monza second, Marillo third, Scott Taylor fourth. We went up in the finals against Chief and we had the car to beat that race. And then uh, we had a header collector come apart on us and basically ran the run with only one turbo. We still almost caught him, but we ended up losing in the final. That was uh, that was a big high and low for me. <laughs> right on, man. Well, it's looking good out here. Excited to see it running uh, with all the gears. And, uh, best of luck to you. Thank you very much. Thank you.